Good morning, good afternoon, good evening guys, wherever you are on this beautiful and ever you're watching this YouTube video. Welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel for the newcomers. My name is Didi. Sorry for the bad quality of image. I don't know, it's the light or something here in this hotel. My Wi-Fi is terrible as well. It's a five-star hotel, it doesn't have Wi-Fi. Um, so I'm going to keep it very short because the uploading of this video will take too long. And I'm still recovering from a little bit of a uh, after wedding dip with a lot of tequila. Now, let's quickly jump into the charts. I have three amazing charts you want to see on this beautiful Monday morning on the 22nd of November. Bam! First one. This is, of course, the four hour chart, guys. And uh, we just saw a really strange candle. It's still being created on the four hour chart, but like a huge wick to the upside and to the bottom, which means that the market is not. Um, deciding which way they want to go uh, we did see a short on the bam bam indicator like you can see here on the top at that moment there was a lot of green and the bam was us not crossing the line yet so i wasn't taking that short the moment we see the candle closing down below the yellow stepping line and a lot of blue or yellow here that is a definite short there was not too much blue we were still in the green the BAM BAM was crossing already, but it was like not all of the confirmation that you are used from the BAM. So that's why I didn't um, take that short, guys. What are we going to see next in Bitcoin? Um, that is a very good question. If I look at this one, the chart that we have been following for a very long time, then, uh, you know, you remember we were going for the purple line and then we should be going for the red line. We are pulling back to this level. And I have a chart where I can show you what I think that is happening at the moment and why you shouldn't be freaking out. So let's quickly jump into that chart as well. So you see what I mean. Bam. Here. This is the day chart. The day chart. This yellow line that you can see uh, running through the day chart. Wait, we'll do it like this. That is um, the line of 2017. That's how 2017 the Bitcoin price moved. Yes. I've been flattening it a little bit, so you can see, you can flatten it a little bit so that it fits the curve, but the curve is fitting perfectly. The bull run top would then be in 25th of December, and you know, the last week of December, like always. But the thing that I want to point out is, check this red box. We were at 52k, we dropped with 25% to that line of the previous tops, you see the tops over here that became the support, so we broke that um, resistance and turned it into support after 25% dip, and after this 25% dip, we flew 70% up, so we took Bitcoin from 40k all the way to 66k, that's 26k extra. Now, we see the same again, if we draw that line here, this green line from the previous top, uh, the intermediate tops, let's call it like that. And we break that. Here is the top. Here we break it. We come up. We hardly tested that um, resistance that we broke. And we didn't retest it as support. But still, we had a 20% drop at the moment. Last time it was a 25% drop that would have been till that level of support. Now we had a 20% drop. What do you think that is going to happen? If you see the yellow line of 2017, if you see what happened the last time after a 25% drop, we went up tremendously with 70%. If we would do the same now, we would go up, for example, with 70%, just, just to show you the number, um, we would be around 100k. Because the drop was only 20%, maybe we will go a little bit lesser, uh, maybe we go only 40% up. And then let's make it a beautiful green. So then you can see, guys, that um, we could easily reach 80k from such a drop of 20%. So that's why I don't think you need to freak out. Now, I have one more chart because else it's going to be too long again. It's already four minutes. I want to keep it around five minutes here. Uh, but that's, I hope that is clear. Now, next chart that is bam over here. This one, I think I found it. The bird is trying to um, do the video as well. I think I found this one on Will Clementis' uh, Twitter. And I really like it because I've been sharing this um, chart a lot of times with you guys as well. Um, the SOPR is on the 24-hour moving average. Look at that yellow line. And now just look at every moment that we came down below the 1 level and near the 0 0.975 level. These are the red circles. Every time... When we came down to the level, look at the price movement after this red 
arrow on top over here. Just look. Every time we came down below that level, we had a big move upward. We came down below, big move. Yeah, this is a huge down below, but we had a big move. Down below, big move. Every time. And now this yellow line again was down below. So we are expecting a big move. Just another pinkish arrow up to somewhere around 80k. Really cool chart. Um, did I forget to post something uh, to tell you something? Yes, I forgot to tell you something. Uh, quickly jump back to BAM over here. Yes, because there is one thing I didn't point out because I closed it already. And that is, if you look at the bottom here, guys, um, here, I will open up this so that you can see that's a stock RSI. The blue is crossing the red and is getting into that bluish box again. Every time that happens, also very bullish look here for example here blue crossing red into the box we went from 29k all the way to 42k here again blue crossing red inside to the box that was the run from here 40k to 60k every time when that happens we have a beautiful run so a lot of things are telling us that we are going to move and um, bam bullish from here take the price up again and i'm always positive because i still believe in the 100k before the end of this year so we need to make the move now in the last week of november very exciting week we are flying back to playa de carmen soon so then the quality of the image will be better again and you can see me and all that stuff <laughs> but i hope you really enjoyed this short video if you did enjoy it give the video a thumbs up share with your friends and family subscribe to the channel hit the notification bell and leave a comment and let me know down below what do you think about these charts and what do you think that bitcoin's next target is thanks for watching and see you tomorrow again bam